Hello and welcome back to our special summer Sunday morning together. I really hope that you've been enjoying your time off school and having lots of fun with your friends and family and you might even be watching this from your holidays somewhere. We've been looking at Moses in the Bible and so far we've heard how he was sent by God to Egypt to rescue God's people, the Israelites, from slavery. After the ten plagues, the Pharaoh finally told the Israelites to go. As they were leaving, though, he changed his mind and chased after them. The Israelites were trapped by the sea until God parted the water and they could escape. So God's people were now on a journey to a land that they would call their very own. God promised them that they would have their own land. So this became known as the land of promise or the promised land. Last week, we heard how the Israelites complained about having no food, but God continued to look after them in the desert. He sent quails and manna to them every day, except the Sabbath day, which God wanted them to keep special. Moses has obeyed God and is leading the Israelites as they travel. As they are traveling, they begin to get thirsty. There isn't any water for them to drink. They started to complain to Moses, we're so thirsty, we need water. Moses asked them, why are you complaining to me? They told Moses that they are so thirsty. Why did they leave Egypt just to suffer in the desert? They are thirsty. The animals are thirsty. The children are thirsty. Moses asked God for help. Moses told God that the people were so upset that they were about to hurt him. What did God want Moses to do? God told Moses, take some of the elders of Israel and go before the people. Take your staff in your hand and I will be with you. Use your staff to hit the rock and water will come out of it. Let the people drink the water from the rock. Moses did just what God told him to do. He took some of the elders with him. When Moses used his staff to hit the rock, the water came pouring out just like God said. All of our stories about Moses so far has shown of so many ways that God was taking care of the Israelites, but they kept forgetting that. They forgot to trust God and just complained instead. God had rescued them from Egypt, saved them from an army at the Red Sea, given them food, and now gave them water from a rock. Over and over again, God wanted to prove to the children of Israel that it was him providing for them. God wanted to leave no doubt that the manna and the water were coming from the almighty, all-powerful God. God wants us to know without a doubt that he was taking care of his people. God wanted Israel to know it was him and to trust him. God wanted Israel. Israel to trust him and he wants your trust too. I'm really glad that you joined us today. There are some worksheets in the Google Drive link in the description of this video for your family to continue their learning and we'll see you again next week.